Okay, hello dear friends. This video I will do some blah 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 and uh, I do not want to waste my time so I will use this blah blah time. Oh, that's quite a, a good sound. Yesterday <coughs> My, my family has never heard about ASMR and, uh, and actually they, they have heard and they were they heard from uh, my video tag and uh, we do not understand this so much and yesterday my husband was watching a video of Tibetan bowls and it was so good <laughs> And I was just laughing. I was just laughing. He spent so much time listening to that bowls. <laughs> Ding. Anyway, <clears throat> so here is the video. I think. Wow, that's too dark. This ink. So. I would like to be concentrate on doing my drawing instead of too much torture. But who knows, there is some gold color. Let me combine some gold here. See, it comes up. It's a beautiful brush. That one is not so good. Okay, that's it. So <clears throat> I have cut out some paper. So I would <clears throat> so I would like to talk some, something blah 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 something about uh, um, what were we talking about I forgot and it's not important if we forgot it means it's not important if we always remember that something important if we forget it's not important do not linger around with something not that much important keep on with life sometimes just slow down and uh, Calculate and do some
do some drawing is kind of fun and uh, <clears throat> so I would like to talk about karma I went to Sacramento and uh, I visited uh, the downtown area Capitol Mall and I parked in N Street and uh, Second Street found the parking I was very lucky and then I visit visited the capital the capital building the courthouse library and um, and um, and uh, the the the, the Anyway, I, I visit this area. So I was, it was a fun tour. So I took my time and enjoy. And then when I came back, I found a parking ticket for $40 something, $30 for the delay and uh, twelve dollar for the administration fee or something. Anyway, so I was quite uh, unhappy. Well, for no reason. You waste forty dollar. It's not a, a pleasant thing, of course. And then I start to think, well, don't cry over spoiled milk because um, <clears throat> knowing how many times I late for for the parking meter, then it's kind of kind of fair there were times I went to the parking meter and uh, and there were many times not so many there were times that we went there it was already expired and uh, nobody noticed so we were not fine so those kind of things happen knowing that we have sometimes that just nobody caught us but we made a mistake we so it's kind of fair we deserve to have uh, to have this parking ticket because we had some we had some before Okay, we have made mistakes before and this time they just didn't caught us. And uh, this time they, they usually they did, do not caught us. And this time they caught us, it's the payment we are paying for the many times we were not being caught. So after thinking this, I felt so much better. So I kept on with my life and then I went to my boys, my boy, to pick him up from the soccer game. So the soccer game was a winning, winning game. They went three to one and uh, my son scored two. So on the way back, I told him the story of my parking ticket. I said, okay, no complaint because because you win the game because I pay the price. <laughs> It is definitely not irrelevant 
not related because he he win the game because of he made effort but uh, <clears throat> in general our life is composed of winning and losing and all these uh, these things so the forty dollar is paid in heaven in advance for for the good luck we have no matter in soccer game or in other things so story should be finished at that and uh, then it happened another story so in in the shop we went to we went to Sacramento and uh, there were 40 minutes something left and it's not enough to go to the city to have a tour with my son and it's too early to leave for the field so we just uh, spent some time in in Sacramento we went some shopping and uh, I didn't buy any clothes I found one pretty dress but I didn't buy so that equals to a save of about uh, twenty dollars thirty dollars do you get what I'm trying to say that uh, this forty dollar of, of fine is anyway the money I will spend I just didn't spend but I spend in the fine and uh, let me keep on with this so we saved money and also it's not related to the to the karma matter to the forty dollar fine matter it's just one of the impression I find there is one shopping mall outdoor shopping mall in Sacramento area and there is uh, uh, an Old Navy Target and another one is Barnes and Nobles I love Barnes and Nobles I'm a teacher I have a teacher's card and uh, and uh, well anyway they are pretty good to me and I buy their bags and origami paper and everything and I went to Barnes and Nobles and uh, the lady in the coffee coffee shop is such a pretty lady so it's one of my limited time impression in Sacramento that the Sacramento people are very very pretty good looking and then we went to Old Navy the cashier lady, the lady who works there oh, she's so pretty and I asked her are you a fashion model? and she said no I'm not a fashion model I said you should be fashion model you do you model the clothes in your shop? she said no and she said you make me blush she's so pretty and just another impression that Sacramento is such a, a pretty place people are very good looking the few people we met are very good looking and another thing this $40 is what's supposed to be spent is that we stayed in a super duper cheap hotel super duper cheap and um, 
if we pay normal price, get a decent hotel, that should be the price. Our paying price plus the $40. So again, the $40 is supposed to be spent. We didn't spend. Now we got to, sorry, another heart attack attack, heart attack sound. Put it to a lowest voice so that you will not get heart attack. And uh, what else? Um, I try to say yes. So this forty dollar you will not escape. It is just supposed to be spent, and we didn't spend. Now it's all in its place. Don't blame other people. Find you. You have trouble you deserve to get this fine and this fine will not go wasted it will become a karma for you it will become a money for the government to increase social security to increase the california um, base salary minimum salary and a lot of things to build a better uh, library system. Anyway, it will be used in many, many places. Okay, I need to... Okay, I will not be distracted by the internet, although it's very important. It's a very dear friend. It's um, a message from a very dear friend, but uh, our moments are composed of all these important dear moments, so there will be no end of this. So when it is time to say no, you say no, you decide yourself, you have to say no. Otherwise, you will be buried by those internet chatting and uh, conversations. So, <clears throat> this $40 is not spent for no reason. There is a reason. And uh, what else I want to say? Oh, yes. So, we... So... My son played very well in this game and he scored a few, he, he scored two goals for three, two win and uh, in another one he scored, he scored in every game. So I'm quite, because soccer is not a, it's not like basketball, you score many, it's just uh, you watch a whole game. Two hours, almost two hours, and no goal, and uh, he did some. I'm very happy for that. So, <clears throat> um, so I paid for it, and uh, I think there are some other ads. Accidents. I'm sorry, I cannot uh, be concentrate. I'm doing this. I enjoy doing this. And um, mm -hmm. I should do something else instead of only bamboo. I just enjoy doing these bamboos. So, um, where were I? Where were I? So yesterday, oh yes, another thing to say that uh, it's not uh, the $40 got paid off is I went to, um, I went to a shop to buy, I will not mention the shop name, to buy, um, memory card for my 
camera for this camera and um, I found they sell at a certain price, a thirty nine ninety nine, and it's quite expensive and uh, it's kind of heartbreaking and I was debating to buy uh, this one or another br uh, or a cheaper one and then at this time when it is spending this much amount of money I call my husband and uh, my husband said okay buy the better one so I decided to buy the better one buy the expensive one $39.99 and then as I I was online waiting to to pay and um, then I start to check online I found Amazon has a cheaper version at that time I'm already <clears throat> in line in any case I will buy and I have no time to wait because um, I have to buy it today if I buy it online the shipping will be too late for me to use so at the counter at the checkout I say okay I found a price on Amazon which is much cheaper $31.49 so do you before I finish the lady on the counter said well let me see so she took my cell phone and uh, check it out and then she checked with another with her colleagues and finally they verified and found it is true Amazon sells the same thing as a much lower price and then they give me they sell me at a low price so again I am saving quite some money so this video has become something maybe make you not happy only talking about money and I have one friend asking uh, did you study economy why do you always talking about money I think what we I am trying to say is not about money it's about karma and if you calculate how much you lose you will find many ways finding yourself that losing money and you are you make you disappoint but if you put your attention into finding the good things the happy accidents then you will be able to find a lot of happy accidents that make you happy and make you feel worth it so it is the same thing in life it's just how you value those things how you see those things and find a reason to make you happy to make you not disappointed to make you more balanced heart do I make sense in this sense so <clears throat> at the end we are happy and uh, and uh, I need some I think I need some let me see I need some paper okay so um So find a reason to make you happy instead of feeling not happy. And uh, what else I want to say? So, <clears throat> and uh, because uh, in Sacramento we were traveling, so we ate outside and um, 
it's always a, a good mathematical lesson for my boys to calculate the tips. So we calculate 10% tips how much, 20% tips how much, 30% how much, and just a, a, a good math education for. And then we gave, he was debating, we were debating how much we should give. And I said, in Chinese, there is a saying, 穷家富路. So, poor house and uh, rich road. So, when you stay at home, you can save money and do it cheap, cheap. But when you go outside, make sure you have enough money and make sure you are give good tips and uh, people give good tips first you are kind to people all the good thing you do will finally return to you you give good tip if next time you go to the same restaurant, they will save, serve you better, right? If you give good tips, even if you do not go to the same restaurant, that person will be happy for a day, will be happy for this service, and he will serve other people with a happy spirit. It's just a, bring out the goodness in people. It sounds a little bit too materialism, but uh, it's pretty sure you do good things. You get good result in you, in others, in many peoples. And um, so we gave good tip and went back and we felt happy and um, Giving tip is not a Chinese thing, actually, but uh, I, I quite uh, appreciate that concept of giving tip, so that uh, it's a, a very simple way to show your appreciation, and it's an easy way. And uh, I always think things that can be settled with money is the easiest thing. And you can settle it with money. It's, it's so much easier, right? And a lot of problems cannot be settled with money. It's not easy. Okay, so we are done with this. I'm running out of paper. I need to cut some paper. At the same time, for the bamboo, maybe I will add another layer of color. So... Add some. Maybe that's not good anyway. Nothing wrong to make an experiment. It's not good. Okay. I will not do that. Uh, I'm damaging this paper, this thing. But we never know. Learning, we pay for our experiment. It's part of the payment we need to give. And Range. 
so I always make my I learned all this from my grandmother. My grandmother has does not know how to read and write and she was not educated as the old time Chinese but she has so much wisdom and uh, yes be nice be kind all the good things will return back to you don't worry you can only make better life by being good being good can only give you a better life nothing less nothing less So these will become bookmarks, no, no, not bookmarks, these will become um, my little cards. Mm -hmm. So this one is about Kama Sacramento, I love this place, I always, I love all these places I have been. And some place give me more disappointment, some place give me less disappointment. And uh, no, this is not a word. Some place give me some disappointment, some place give me more. But wherever you go, when you think it's, uh, it's actually your heart make this place, whatever this place is. If you have a peaceful heart, kind heart, and just uh, the right mindset, you can enjoy any place, every place. If you feel this world own you something, no place can make you a happy place. You are visiting a new place, but you are revisiting your inner heart. Thank you, everyone. I will move on to do some more video. To move on to do some more. Um, uh, 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 a video and uh, and cards and so this is the video about uh, karma whatever happens temporarily you see maybe a, 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 a loss maybe not worth it maybe make you not happy but you always have to think the better part of it looking at the bright side of the world looking at the bright side of the world bye bye friends i will keep on making cars and doing another video happy every day bye bye friends okay let's go you just need to pay the price for everything. Think positive.